Well, good morning. Welcome back to my hunting channel. Yeah, I'm not dressed as a hunter today, but I am talking to you today a little bit about what we're doing. Setting up a new blind area. My wife and I were out here earlier this morning before the heat come in and I didn't bring my cell phone like a nut. So recording was not exactly easy and how to set it up. You already saw me set up the HME hunting blind. Okay, so now what we have done, we have positioned it in the woods ready to hunt for this season. The season's a month away, roughly, and uh, trying to get the deer used to the blind being there before we hunt. If they see something new, you know, they get kind of skittish, I'm told. It really doesn't matter. So, what did we do? We set the hunting blind up. So, we're gonna walk up to it here, and I'm gonna show it to you as we walk up to it. So, let me turn this thing around and get going. As you can see, I got some really thick woods out here. This little clearing over here produces deer. I'm going to pan around. There you have it. There's the blind. In this little area right here, I get a lot of deer come through here. A lot of deer. They come up through the ravine over here in front of us, which is right there in front. And they like to walk up through here. As you can see, there's a trail and a path from deer. So me and the wife put the blind up this morning and I'm going to show you inside the blind too once I get over here out of the way I got a lot of sticky things but yeah I cut down a little saplings here make a little clearing I mean this is perfect they come up through this draw and they come off that ridge like I said right here they come down and they like to come up this trail I've seen them I've got pictures as you can see my trail camera and this is our ground blind Wife did a great job in helping me camouflage it a little bit, break out the outline of it so it don't really look like a blind. Looks like a bush, like it's supposed to. And I have deer coming behind me probably too. I don't know. Most of the time I see the pictures, they're actually coming from here. And they go that way. They've never come down from this way, so that's different. So let's stop here, and I'm going to show you the inside of the blind. So as we come up to the opening, very small. I've already got a chair and set up in here. Got everything set inside the HME. Ooh, kind of dark in here, ain't it? You know, this is easier for me to get in and out. Oops, let me pause. So there you have it. There is a view that I need to hunt. I gotta do a little bit more work in here. I gotta put another brace. Nothing's gonna interfere with the shot too much. I'm not gonna shoot this way, but at least I can see the deer coming. I'm gonna keep this partially closed. The one in the back will stay closed because I want it as dark as possible. And there's the door that I came in, the view from the other side. So, as you can see, I'm pretty much content to sit in this area, unlike the other one. I just got to modify my seating arrangements because it's sinking in the mud. So I can sit comfortably and not worry about falling down. My chair swivels, as you can see. I got plenty of room just to sit here and be quiet. And hopefully Bambi comes up. I might raise my window over here just a tab. You know, trying to keep it dark, but yet I don't want to interfere with my shots. So, anyway, I wanted to share with this with you. So, hold on. Let's get back outside. It's hot in here. Okay, that's better. It's outside here, or it's cooler. Anyway, this is my hunting area. As you can see, like I said, behind me, HME Belize. Hunter is made easy. And it's a three-man blind, but I would tell you two is perfect, or even one's better. And I can't complain about that one. I do want to thank you for watching my channels. Sorry about this, I'm moving around because I'm hot as hell. And uh, it's not easy being out here in the woods and the humidity. And today is only nine o'clock and it's already feels like it's a hundred degrees, but I know it's not. But I want to thank you for watching my channel and uh, stay tuned for the hunting. I will hunt this blind. It'll probably be evening hunts or something. Come here about two o'clock or so and sit in the stand and see what happens. But I'm also going to use it for turkey. I figured let me get a ground shot because I've seen turkey run through here too. So I've got pictures of both. So hopefully this year will be a successful year and I'll be able to hunt and enjoy myself. All right. So thank you for watching. Stay tuned and uh, let's get to hunt.